Hi, my name is Brian Mahaney. I am a former law enforcement officer from New Jersey and Louisiana, a former prosecutor in New Orleans, and a former assistant attorney general in Maine. Today, I am a whistleblower lawyer in private practice representing folks who file Medicaid fraud complaints. Because of my unique experience, I have been asked to record this short video on the best way to report healthcare fraud. Obviously, because you are watching this video, you probably know that Medicaid and Medicare fraud cost taxpayers billions of dollars each year. When the fraud involves performing unnecessary surgeries or procedures, it also endangers human life. Our goal is to stop these fraudsters before they can ruin more lives and damage our economy. There are two primary ways you can report Medicaid fraud. The easiest method is to call a government toll-free hotline. The federal government operates a hotline for Medicare fraud. Most states have similar hotlines for Medicaid fraud. You can report anonymously and may even get a $1,000 award. Unfortunately, the easiest way to report Medicaid fraud is often not the best. Medicare and Medicaid fraud hotlines receive thousands of calls annually. Sadly, many of the complaints are never investigated. It's not that government officials are lazy, there simply aren't enough agents and prosecutors to investigate every complaint. So is there a better way to report? Yes. The federal government, 30 states, and the District of Columbia allow citizens to work with a lawyer and file a False Claims Act or KETAM complaint. A unique law passed during the American Civil War allows private individuals, folks like you, to file a complaint in the name of the government. If your lawyer or the government is successful in recovering money from these wrongdoers, you can earn between 15% and 30% of whatever the government collects. When you read about a whistleblower receiving tens of thousands of dollars, hundreds of thousands of dollars, or even millions of dollars, chances are he or she filed a False Claims Act complaint. In 2014, the federal government paid out $435 million in False Claims Act awards. States paid out tens of millions of dollars more in Medicaid fraud KETAM awards. How do I know? Our clients received over $100 million. False Claims Act complaints generally go to the top of the government's investigation list, and a good lawyer can also help protect you from retaliation should that occur. Let's summarize. The easiest method to report Medicaid fraud is calling a hotline. It takes seconds and you may even get a small token award. If you are serious about stopping greed and corruption, are interested in a large award, or worried about retaliation, I suggest speaking with a False Claims Act lawyer. Use the special whistleblower hotline number on this website. If the case involves immediate danger to health and human safety, call a False Claims Act lawyer right away. He or she can help get you immediate government intervention and protect your rights as a whistleblower. Have more questions? Feel free to contact me. Even if you have already made a Medicaid fraud complaint, I am always happy to answer questions. My contact information appears on the screen. Hotline or False Claims Act, make sure you do report. Whistleblowers are the new American heroes. They are also the government's first line of defense against Medicaid fraud.